now I'm coming back into the centre, I've just driven out and had a look around and uh, it certainly seems a very nice little village as well, no? town if it's not a village. Beloved architecture to the left. It's the first sign I've seen for the, uh, the memorial to the left. Back into the town centre and the Schloss. Oh, there's the museum. back over the river. There seems to be three um, bridges. This is the Castle Ridge, oh nice building there. Railway station. Psychiatry. So once again, like the first time I was in Treblinka, the first time I was in Sobibor, I find myself in an extremely attractive place. A uh, rather large mental complex, which is uh, so complex for people with some mental problems. Um, and uh, it had been for some time. This is one of six institutions the Nazis uh, used uh, for murdering people. The others were um, Grafenek, which is in the south near Stuttgart, Piena, which is near Dresden, where I'm going tomorrow. Um, Brandenburg, Hartheim in Austria. Uh, as Hartheim sent most of the people, the murderers, off to uh, first the Belgians, and then to uh, and they some that went to Treblinka or Sobibor. Well. Now, um, it was in this building where the people were killed according to the signs. Um, the, uh, we have here the, uh, we've got some information up here, about how the buses came in here. So the, this is the garage, there were three buses that used to collect people from various institutions, bring them in here, people were let out, and according to the signs here, they were taken into one of the buildings or into a cellar, and there they were, they were gassed. Um, we can have a look at uh, some of the photographs that are quite well known. Um, nothing terribly unusual here. But the, the photographs of the smoke coming out. Oh, sorry, I just remembered. I forgot to mention Bernberg on Andy Sal, which isn't far from Leipzig. That was also another uh, place uh, that people murdered. Um, here it's believed that around 10,000 people were killed. Uh, somewhere in the region of 70, 75,000 people were murdered in this, 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 this wave of killing in these uh, six centres, which, um, which uh, effectively, theoretically ended uh, on Hitler's instructions in August of 1941, the same time as people were actually taken to 
uh, the, the, the murderers, uh, Christian Wirt and others, uh, went to uh, Poland. Although the first gas van had been used by um, Hackenholt in Belgium, uh, before, not quite before then, sorry, no, at the same time, we got the idea from here. The gas van came from here first and then he, he, he converted the post office van there from what he knew from here. The gas vans were painted grey. In, in Berlin there's a rather unusual memorial uh, to them at the bus station. There. This is because the garage, not the not the place where people were in just So I've got into the museum or the or the building anyway, but here as we can see there's the there's the remembrance uh, place, uh, hand on the wall, <coughs> not working. There's the bell, I think that's the bell. Oh, the bell. Nobody there. Let's clear off. No, oh, never mind. We have a bit of cabaret from a man called Heydrich. Um, uh, it was put on here on November 1994, uh, 14 years ago, on the anniversary of Crystal Night. Political cabaret with songs and ditties from the resistance. like this, but I hope it was, as it was in Germany, I'm sure it was all in good taste. Uh, a number of things. So it's utterly clear that the link has been made here uh, between the uh, murder of the Jewish population and what actually happened here. to remember the victims. Nineteen ninety. Fifty years.